Hi there, it's Paul at SketchUp.expert, author of Construction Documents Using SketchUp Pro, originally written in 2020, but updated just recently for 2024. I'm going to be presenting the improvements to SketchUp and Layout since 2020 in a series of short videos. So I hope you'll join me. First up is the Flip Tool. The Flip Tool is a really fundamental function that's been added to SketchUp fairly recently and I was delighted to see it. It allows you to, as you'd expect, flip objects. Um, also, it has a mirror function, which I'll demonstrate. You'll find it on the standard toolbar about halfway down, and it's two triangles back to back with a space in between. As I float the cursor over the tool, you'll see the tooltip showing up there, and it indicates that there is a shortcut I can use as well, which is the Alt F shortcut if i hold down alt and i hit f i'll also get that to work okay so you can see that the tool is looking for an object to interact with and so i'm gonna first of all flip this um, 3d text i have over here so i click on that and you can see the three planes generated there you can also see when I float around, there's another kind of plane that that shows up, which is the in, in magenta, which is um, kind of looking for random planes to select. And OK, so what happens here is, as, as you'd imagine, it's pretty straightforward. Click on plane and it will flip the object about that plane. If I want to get it to do the mirror function, I just tap again the Alt key on a Mac or Control on Windows. So I tap the key and you can see it's actually done a, a mirror function there. It's kind of done it by default because I was already mirroring the object. Um, I'm just going to undo that. Hit Escape. What I'm going to do is I'm going to flip the object about the blue plane, um, but I want it to kind of flip up to here. So what I do is just drag the mouse up, uh, float onto the blue plane, drag the mouse up, just let go at a particular spot. The object is copied and flipped, pretty straightforward. Um, you can see that the mirror functionality is still operating there because the plus sign is still visible. Uh, so let's say I can go to another plane and it will do the same thing again okay and there's also functionality in flip where um, i can float on adjacent objects to find a plane to operate in so we picked this this face here on another object and we can even we can even drag that away we'll get the object to flip about that now it kind of sticks with that plane once i had selected it and uh, if I click again it's going to copy it you can see how that works it's fairly straightforward there's one other function or I'll just mention you can use the up down and left right arrow keys on your keyboard to work with the flip tool up is going to operate in the blue plane I'm just going to tap the up arrow and it you can see it it'll flip in the blue direction right red and left green as with any tool you'll always see options visible at the bottom of your screen the window that i have here that's not visible so that is the flip tool i hope you learned something there i'm going to be doing a few more videos on improvements since SketchUp 2020 hope to uh, see you in the next one let me know if you have any questions or comments in the comment area below. Thanks. There are still some architects that do not know how to use SketchUp.